Shout out to the homie, bump the sum. Trap queen! I shouldn't really be yelling, guys. Dude. I have a really bad sore throat, and trust me, it's painful right now. I'm sorry, but this is the worst thing ever. I might need surgery. I might need to get my tonsils removed. I don't know yet, but it's kind of scary. I'm not going to lie. I had two really bad sore throats, and when I be really bad, I mean, my tonsils get inflammated. You know, it's painful to swallow. It's painful when I'm even just have my mouth closed. And it's something kind of serious. And hopefully, you know, once this gets better, I'm going to try to take care of myself more and see what's causing it. Therefore, I won't, I won't get any more. I won't have to have surgery. But either way, this is not about me. Today's video is talking about chemistry and something that's really important. I feel it gets looked over a lot. So chemistry is very important, guys, for so many reasons. One, not only because, you know, you guys played together for a long time, but you guys also know all your strats. You guys know everything together. You know, you played so much together. For example, let's talk about Optic for a second. Uh, also, I want to give a shout out. Congrats to Optic for, you know, winning X Games and to Scum for having two chains now. You know, he's, he's a good guy. He's a good boy. So let's look at them for a second. You guys know they played so well together, right? They got first. And I feel like what it takes them so far is the chemistry. You know, they've gone so far in every tournament. They got second, first, first, seven, first, 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 or, or something like that. And the chemistry is so good. If you realize that, like their, their communication, uh, the way they, they the way they talk to each other, for example, like they're really comfortable, really happy with each other, you know, and they, they, they always tell each other what they did wrong or something like that to help each other get better. And that's true chemistry right there. It's like I've done for a second. You know, they've been teaming me since the beginning of the game, right? They're, they're a team of three, yeah. Karma, Formal, and Scump. And the only player who has ever been changed was Nate Shaw. And even then, they teamed for Nate Shaw for like four events. Then they went to Karma. And, you know, they've been a team of three forever. If you have a team of three that's been playing together so long, you know, you guys have really good chemistry. You know, if they play so much together, they know what each other do. They, they're comfortable with each other. You know, they, they play well. And the chemistry is so important. Boy. I think about it. They've screamed since the beginning of game. What's that? Seven, eight months? They put in so much time, so much work. Hours and hours and hours and hours of playing together. And, you know, when it comes down to respawn, their respawn is so dominant because they know exactly how to play it at, by this time. At this point in game, they know how to play perfectly. That's why they're so ahead than others. You know, it's not only the raw skill. Don't get me wrong. Optic has some raw ass skill. You know, Scump is a god. You know, he's really good. But it comes more to that. You know, it's more than that. It's that chemistry that helps them become so much more ahead, so much more advanced. If you have three players that know exactly how to play the game, you know, almost to the T. You have, and they're so good, you know, individually. Their skill is so good. It just helps them pretty much win so many maps, especially respawn, a game type that is so consistent as long as you guys are consistent at slaying and know how to play the map. Jesus Christ, I'm almost done with this game. It's, I'm so ahead right now. Or either way, you look at, you look at a team like Optic Nation who, they, they, might, they may not be the best individually skilled, but when it comes down to it, they play so good together. Yeah, they have, you know, so-so placings, but have you ever seen them play a match that you thought they would lose to? You know what helped them win that? It's just the chemistry they have together. They know how to play S and D together. You know, they're just... That chemistry helps so much. I'm telling you guys, it gets overlooked a lot. You can think of it as Cole. You know, they team together for a long time. All right, this guy sucks. I gotta let him kill me. Yeah, Cole and Black Ops 2 to Ghost. You know, they had the same three core players. They only replaced two quick, like in the middle of Black Ops 2 for Clayster. And they started winning tons of events. But they were a team of three that played together so much. You know, they know exactly how they played. They know how to work around each other. They felt really comfortable. And that's what made them dominant. Or a team like E6, who's just an upcoming team, they're very really good. You know, they won the mess land or whatever it was. And there was like two pro teams that were pretty good. But either way, you know, they've been showing their dominance. They do everything together. And that's the chemistry right there I'm talking about. Either way, guys, I just wanted to rant a little bit about chemistry because it's really important. Think about it the last couple of videos I did. Chemistry, good vibes, and communication. These three things are factors in winning outside of skill, you know, Teams like Optic, FaZe, they all have individual skill, you know, they have raw ass skill. But what makes them so much more ahead of these teams, that's why FaZe is getting second, is the communication, is the good vibes they have with each other, and it's the chemistry. You know, that's what it is. If you hear enable, if you hear Optic and FaZe, especially Enable, communicate with each other, the communication is so flawless, it's so good. They have a lot of good vibes, you know, constantly saying, good job, nice, and keep it going, like, no negativity, that's what you need. Either way, I'm done telling you my secrets. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then why haven't you placed good? Well, I placed second two events ago. But either way, man, it sucks that they go to X Games. But hopefully, you know, the relegation, we can get first and then keep it going from there. Thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. This has been your boy, Apathy, and I'm out. Love being with, spending time with, always having a blast. You know, you can mess around with, you can be yourself. It's we like, do whatever you want, you know? <laughs> I, I, I can laugh like that in front of her. She won't care. She'll just We're laugh. <laughs>
So yeah, guys, time is ticking. I gotta be back. I gotta go in about an hour or so to go pick her up. Uh, well, yeah, to go pick her up, and we're gonna head to the beach, get some pictures going, and then some sunset pictures. And I wanted to do this video before I go because I am not gonna miss a day. I don't know. I'm gonna always find a day. You know, when there's a day where I think, oh, I can't do a video, I'm doing a video. I'll find it. I'll find the time. I'm gonna work around it because hell no, I'm missing.